Hey, al chet shechatanu lefanecha. For the sin that we have committed before you, we are entering uh, the final days of the ten days as we come into the period right before Yom Kippur. And we have the vidui, the confession, over and over again on Yom Kippur. We, we beat our chests and we confess our sins. But are we really meant to be beating ourselves up in that harsh way? You know, the word sin is a difficult word, it's a harsh word, and the Hebrew word chet really is about missing the mark. We tried. We tried to live the best lives we could, and you know what? We're human, and so we missed the mark. And really the al chet is just uh, gently tapping our hearts and saying, you know what? Heart, human heart is such a complex organ, and it's really the heart that leads all of our actions and all of our thoughts. And so we're just gently inviting our hearts to be a little more open and a little more soft in this coming year so that we can be better so that the intentions we have to do good and to be good in this world can be lived through open soft hearts so i really invite us all as we enter these days and as we go into yom kippur to to be a little self-compassionate not to beat ourselves up and not to end Yom Kippur with a bunch of bruises all over our chests, but rather to end Yom Kippur with open hearts ready to take on the world. Gemach Hatimah Tova is the greeting that we say, which is really asking that we be not just written, but sealed, sealed in the Book of Life for a good year and a sweet year with open and loving hearts. Gemach Hatimah Tova.